everyone, it's Friday. Welcome to a new weekend vlog. Follow's here. Hi. So I am currently about to go to B and M. Forgot where I was going there, and to the pharmacy for my gran. So I'm gonna go and do those things just now, and then also um, a little quick couple of things at Tesco. Um, Paul is staying in, and then I'm stuck in. Yeah, Paul's stuck in because of being a close contact. Anyway, and then what else? Oh, James is with my mum. Um, she took him for a couple hours, so he's out just now. And then, yeah, I'll let you know what we got up to later. But I'll show you when I'm out and stuff, what I'm getting. A wee look around B&M, see if there's anything new and interesting to show the people. <laughs> anyway, okay, check in soon. Bye, have fun. Okay, I've been to B&M, there wasn't anything that good, so I just didn't film in there. And then I got my granny's prescription, so I now need to go to Tesco and then go and drop it off to her. So that's the plan for just now. I love this new health centre because there's so many spaces, like, so many more spaces. Normally, right now, you would be, like, fighting for a space in the other one, whereas I parked here and there's a ton of spaces down there. So it makes me feel really good about, like, when we have to come back for appointments with James and stuff. And they also now have parent and child parking, which they never had before, so that is a huge improvement. Sorry, my face is all red because it's warm in the car, so I'm going to go and turn the car on so I can get air conditioning. Okay, I'm home. I am making this pasta that we love because it's quick. You can have it cold or you can heat it and it stays good for a few days. So I'm going to show you what it is. Um, I'm using farfalle, which is like bow ties. And then I'm going to do this. So this is bacon lardons. We use smoked. I use the two pack. And I'm going to do this till they're crispy and then add in the other ingredients, which I'll show you in a wee second once I'm doing it. So we'll see how long this takes, but I like the bacon to be crispy. Okay, so I've now strained the pasta and added one tin of this Campbell's condensed soup, cream of chicken, great for cooking it says. Um, and then I added a bit of water to try and get the most of that out. And then I'm gonna add the bacon. So as I said, I like it crispy. I also like to put it in a paper towel to absorb any of the extra oil because I just don't want that especially when it's being stored so I'm going to add this in mix it in and then show you the finished product so now we have a finished chicken and bacon pasta that I'm going to leave just now because we will have this once James goes to bed and I'll just give you the verdict then we add salt and pepper and then sometimes we add um like chili flakes like red pepper flakes to make it a little bit spicy but it's good we like it so James is in bed, it's a wee fight uh, to get him over, I think he was just over tired <coughs> but we finally got him down which is good um, Samantha made tea, a pasta with bacon lardons and Campbell's chicken soup for Fally pasta, very tasty, quick, easy and tasty so I like it. <laughs> this is my second bowl. So, put a wee bit of salt and pepper on it. So, because we don't put salt in our food, just in case James is going to try any. Um, so, I'm going to eat this and going to watch the Belgium Italy game. So, catch up later. Bye. Good morning. It is Saturday morning. Say morning, James. So James slept from about 7.45 till 7.30. Didn't get up once, but he's done it. So well done, James. If you hear that annoying squeak, or it's James's water bottle. He likes a drink of juice in the morning. So we get them to drink water, isn't it? Just a wee touch of the oat and juice. Yeah, hiya. Wave. <laughs> Who's the best boy in the world? Who's the best boy? Yeah, Jesus! Where's your cute face? Where's your funny face? Be cute. Oh, nice. Oh. No. So, 
plan for today. We'll get James breakfast and then you're going for a sleepover at Granny and Grandas, aren't you? I'm free today, which is good. Isolation is annoying. <laughs> but we got there, didn't we? Yay! <coughs> right, we shall check in later. Say bye bye. We then bye bye. Say hiya. Just woke up from my app. Look at my crazy hair. Haven't you? <laughs> and it's lunchtime, isn't it? What have we got, James? We've got broccoli, tomato, and carrot stuff that your mum made. Looks good, doesn't it? Yeah. Is it? And then for afters, we have grated apple and some strawberries. Yeah? Sounds good. Who's the best boy in the world? James! Where's your funny face? Oh, nice. James, be cute. You don't be cute? No. Oh. James. Oh. Baba. Baba. Black sheep. Have you any room? Baba. Baba. Yeah. Baba. Right, we're going to go and shall check in later. Say bye bye. Hey. See you. Hi everyone, this is the first time I'm actually in the vlog today. Um, we are on our way to Brayhead for just a bit of a wonder, to be honest. Um, and have a look at maybe some summery stuff. And we'll see. Say hi, Pop. Mm. I know you've already vlogged this morning. <laughs> Anyway, James has been picked up, so we're in the car now. Just kind of getting out of the house for a couple hours, isn't it? Since I've been locked up. Yeah. <laughs> so, we'll check in when we're there. But, I'll chat soon. Okay, hi everyone. We're home. We went to Brayhead. It was a bit busy. Like, a bit weird. Well, not weirdly busy, I guess. Nobody can go anywhere. Um, but, I've got a couple of things. I'll show you. Oh, I've got some Lush bath bombs that I'll put away soon and some egg meal sandwiches from Boots because they're my absolute favourite sandwich ever. I'm going to have one soon. And then when I got home, my phone had died and I made these banana muffins. Um, But I'll keep you updated throughout the rest of the night and stuff. But I just, that's all I did. I think I'm going to clear out James's clothes soon. But I'll see. I'll see if I have the energy for it. I'm so tired. I'm going to eat one of these banana muffins, maybe have a bath and then do that. Paul is currently outside emptying the bin. He's about to walk in the door. <laughs> anyway, so I'll check in later. Bye guys. Okay, so I'm running my bath. So I have, in the bath I have Dr. Teal's foaming bath, the Susan Sleep one. I have the neat Arnica mineral bath salts. I really like these. I have also the lavender relaxing bath oil now this is blue and the thing the bath salts are yellow and this is making my bath a green color so here's the color of the bath just now and then i just filled up these um so i've got two twilight two comforter one avo bath and two um intergalactic because i know i had one avo bath already i'm not going to use one tonight because i have other stuff in the bath oh i also put in a little bit of my Guilty Pleasure by Lavon from L'Occitane. Love it so much. It's the best ever, but it's so expensive. Well, it's £26, which I think is so expensive for bubble bath. But anyway, so running my bath now. Going to get in this soon. Okay, so it is just about 7 o'clock. I've just had my bath. Our Chinese has arrived. But, like, I'm not kidding. My husband is the nicest person in the world most of the time. So, basically all the time, but you know what I mean. Anyway, so... So I'm just at my bath at seven o'clock and I am not kidding when I say that my husband is extremely thoughtful and like so nice. So basically I was like getting out of my bath and he's like, oh, I'm going to go out for a second. I was like, where are you going? And he's like, oh, I was standing at the window. I'm watching these little kids play with a football, 
but they've kicked it and it's went somewhere and I don't think they're allowed to go get it because they're just kind of standing. So he has just walked to like the edge of our street and is away trying to help this little boy get his ball back because he watched him from the window and saw that he probably wasn't allowed to like, because, so there's like a bit of a path that isn't on the road that a lot of the time the kids play on. So it must be like that the wee boy's allowed on the path, but not allowed on the road. So Paul is away down and I think he's under a car because currently what I can see is a car. I'm not going to show you our front for safety reasons, but um, currently I think Paul is under a car trying to get a ball back for a child. How nice is that? Like went out the house and stuff to go and help him. Anyway, so I'm going to play our Chinese now while he's out doing that. He's back. It was a lot further than he thought it was. It was a trick. <laughs> But, but he went and the wee boy was all happy. The wee guy cried like three times for his ball. It's just a wee boy. 20 quid Champions League ball. And that's seen it out the window. So I was like, it's cold, not a later street, obviously. Mm -hmm. and that's it, well. So we went and got it for him. How cute is that? that? Anyway, okay, I'll check in later. <laughs> Good morning, it is Sunday. Please ignore the huge kind of like spot thing on my face there. Oh, what are you doing? Oh my god, it's so dark in here. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hello. Paul was up early this morning, I was not. I think, what time did you wake up at? Quarter to eight. Quarter to eight, and I got up at half ten. <laughs> anyway, it's now almost twelve. We're having food, and then I'm gonna go in my bath. Paul's already ready. And then we'll see what the day brings, but the weather looks a bit weird, like it's a bit dull. Probably gonna rain. Yeah, I think it's gonna rain. Looks like cloudy and yucky. Anyway, check in later. Bye. Yes, he's eating a shoe. <laughs> Say hi, ya. <laughs> Come away from the radiator. <laughs> this boy is a hazard now. He he wants to walk all the time and he's not um, stable all the time he's tired <laughs> on a night james Woo. Stable he's been since he's been home. <laughs> you get a sock? Oh, don't get a sock now. Oh. Oh, Say wow. hey. Oh. Oh. Yeah, oh, because you're shouting. Oh. <laughs> No, hey, just fell. Oh, uh. Say hiya. Oh. Can you wave? Wave to the baby. Where's the baby? Where's the baby? Where's the baba? Wave to the baba. Can you show out your mouth and wave? Kisses for the baba. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so I think this is our Sunday plan, just chilling the rain. It's on earlier and it's a bit of a miserable day, so we're just going to chill. We might go where we drive, depending on how James is. It was fell against that right there. Woo! <gasps> what are you doing? Right, we'll check in later. Check in later. Okay. Okay, it's Monday. I'm making James's lunch. He is having some penny pasta with some broccoli that I had pureed a while ago with milk. And then I've put in one of these little bags of Cathedral City, like mini cheddar things, like bits of cheese. And then I'm prepping his meal. So I've got sweet potato. I've already put tomatoes and peas in there. And I'm going to put in, I've put in potatoes as well. So I just need to blend these, put that in, and then that'll be his meals for the week. Well, part of the freezer stuff. I wasn't sure I was going to be on this again tonight. So James was playing with my phone. 
and threw it down behind the radiator. <clears throat> and we've just spent the past almost two hours trying to get it out. And when we got it out, it was on the phone to the police. And me in a panic hung up instead of staying on the phone and explaining to the police. So then I spent the last 20 minutes trying to phone the police to say that everything's fine. But they phoned me back, so that just shows you. I will not be surprised if we get a wellness check within the next hour or two. Because you just never know. Because I think I'm sure they get calls like that all the time. However, I felt so bad and I still feel so bad that we waste the police time without realising we waste the police time. But it's crazy how much they know about you. Like, he knew my address and my, my name. From your phone. Probably from my phone or, like, from details that they have. But, yeah, straight away. Samantha, is that you? Yes. So crazy. the reason we couldn't get it is because... Yeah, it didn't just fall behind the radiator. It fell behind the skirting. And the, the skirting is next to the radiator. Yeah, behind the radiator. And there's not enough space between the radiator and the skirting for the phone to have fallen out. So then it fell like behind the skirting bit. And then Paul was trying to saw it at one point. Crazy. I'm going to get my tools out. He literally has it's his tools. Secure the sideboard. So that skirting bit right there. So see how it moves? I don't know if you can see it from here. Mm-hmm. Need to secure that onto the wall. Yeah. So James can't do it again. Look at all the tools. We had tongs, tongs a back scratcher, proper. the legs of James's high chair. Yes. And I had a rope. I had a rope. This was working. Yeah. 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 No damage to it. And no damage to it. But, oh my goodness. Embarrassing. Mm -hmm. Totally embarrassing. Maybe even watch the search with her up. I think, what do you think? Do you think they will or not? No. You don't think they will? I think they might. I hope not. I think they might. Because you never know. With all these things, like, I know I'm totally fine. But you never know with these things. Like, somebody could call back and you'd be like, oh yeah, I'm totally fine and you're not. So maybe they will turn up. Who knows? Anyway, I'm going to go just now. We're going to make dinner. We're starving. Okay, good morning. We're about to go swimming. I have my swimsuit on under this dress, which is why this looks weird. Anyway, um, I put on a little bit of vitamin C serum and I did a little bit of eyebrows today because last time I didn't and then I didn't when I go back. Hi. Ba ba black sheep. Baba. Have you any wool? Ba ba. Ba ba black sheep. Baba. This is James's new song. You see it. Black sheep. Black sheep. Yay! Who's the best boy in the world? Woohoo! You even? Good boy. See, we're going to go swimming. You go swimming? Yeah. Okay, we'll check in later. Okay, we're here. And we're just about to go swimming. <gasps> Yay! James still looks tired. <laughs> and was not very happy about his dummy coming out. But we're going to go swimming now, so I'll check in later. Uh, Bye, guys. Okay, if you haven't seen the clothing declutter video, you need to watch it. Because this is what I'm getting rid of so far. Plus, there's some stuff there from James's room. And then there'll be some stuff... I'm doing again, but how much tidier? How much stuff? Goodbye. Hi everyone, it is Tuesday, I think. No, it's Wednesday, it's Wednesday, it's Wednesday. Anyway, it's Wednesday. I am now home. Obviously, I've been home all day. But I mean, um, I'm running a bath, but I had a little bit of a project I did today. It's not like a crazy project, but it was just a quick declutter and this area now behind next to the sink is like empty so i have james's clothes hanging in the wash out there and i am about to go in a bath because james is away with paul's parents just for a little bit um and yeah i'm gonna go in a bath just now because i've been having my baths too late and that's making me tired oh these are the best these organic apple rice cakes are like apple and cinnamon 
I feed James them so I can eat them myself. Mmm. Okay, I'll check in later. Hi everyone, it is Thursday. It is windy, but it's actually quite warm. So we're down at the Esplanade going for a bit of a walk, just me and James. Paul's working. Um, as I said, we're trying not to really go places and stuff for various reasons, which I will hopefully be letting you guys know soon. But um, at the minute, we're just down a wee walk. The Esplanade to get some fresh air. He's a bit bored in the house. Hi everyone, it's Friday, so I'm just finishing off last week's vlog to start this week's vlog, I guess. Um, but I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe, and we'll see you again soon. Bye, guys.